it really is like a writing desk and just a nice accessory to the master room. It almost seems like a secretary set up uh, to write down all the information before you go in the room and have sex. If I go by 2 chains. 2 chains. I'm over the top sometimes. Wow. Seriously? And right now we're going to check out the most expensive shit. And it's definitely crazy. What up, what up, it's 2 chains. Today on most expensive shit, the Jewel Penthouse, New York Palace. I mean, it comes with a Maybach, a butler, but where are the hookers? Check it out. How you doing? Yeah, how you doing? Two chains. Two chains. David Chase, general manager here nice at the palace. Nice to meet you. What's going on, man? I just wanted to show you the jewel suite. Heard a lot about the jewel suite. Three bedrooms, six bathrooms, lots of incredible space to hang out in, party in, and uh, be romantic. We partnered with a guy named Martin Katz. He's a Beverly Hills jeweler. And obviously you have jewels in here. He actually keeps a few million dollars of his jewelry here in the suite, which is kind of crazy. Okay. Real stuff, really? not fake stuff. This cascading chandelier we call the Waterfall of Diamonds, all over the place. 40 feet tall. It's, uh, I don't know, tw 20 something. Yeah. We'll get the tape measure up. We call this main space the Grand Parlor because it's so grand. 18 foot windows. Luckily, we've got a day that's not too hazy outside. This suite is really comfortable for obviously hanging out, doing TV or whatever. So I can throw a party in here? You, uh, you can throw a party, you just gotta be careful of the carpet. What's a night in this room gonna cost me? Well, we're friends now, so you get a discount, but anybody else who calls me, it's $25,000 a night. Damn! You know, here's the thing. You, you got people who will come for a few nights, they'll come for a week or 10 days, and then truth is, I'll have people who will rent it a month at a time. $25,000 a night. You're doing the math on your three night stay? I'm not gonna be able to stay three nights. When you commit to a several month stay, we're gonna do the suite for $250,000, $300,000 a month. Now, compared to that $25,000 a night, it's a, down, it's a downright bargain. It's a bargain? Here's what I've learned in this business. Everything's relative. So tell me what comes for two fifty dollars a month. You've got dedicated concierge, dedicated staff in the private lobby downstairs. You've got butler service. You've got room service, of course, because we're a full-service hotel, 24-hour room service. You have to pay for the food, sir. Oh, you got to pay for the food. Damn. All that's right. A, you know, that's how we, that's the extra. Any kind of that food and beverage, event service stuff, it's all in-house, so we can make all that happen. But yeah, you're paying for it as you as you use it. Our house car, which is a Maybach, that can run you around town nearby or whatever you need. Run you around town? Well, because you, you don't want to leave if you're going to pay to stay here. I like to go to Harlem and eat. He can take me to Harlem? Well, for, for you, because you're in this suite, yes. What kind of people, what kind of clientele do you have? Is this place, like, vacant half the time, or do you have people that constantly want to spend 25000 a night? Truth is, it is probably vacant half the time, because I probably book it about half or a little less of the time. Sometimes celebrity, sometimes royalty. We actually do a lot of Saudi and royalty, prince princess business. And then just businessmen or businesswomen who, you know, know our hotel, know these big suites, and uh, that's just their choice to use these, uh, these large spaces. We're taking the grand staircase up to the second floor. This is the master bedroom. This little room outside of the master, it's set up almost to do private jewelry showings here within the suite. It really is like a writing desk and just a nice accessory to the master room. With 25,000, it should, it should come with a uh, massage. It should come with, with a hooker. We don't offer all those services, but we have a spa. I'd probably throw in a massage. And this is the master suite with it, a huge, this is the master bathroom. huge bathroom. I can't lie, I spend a lot of time in the bathroom too. We've seen parties in here of 60 people. It's just partying going on everywhere. Alcohol is loud music. It's occasional hints of uh, marijuana smoke. Luckily, there's a terrace, so people can smoke outside. Gotcha. I want to look at it. To get to the third floor terrace, the only way to get up there is to actually take the private elevator. Oh, damn. Uh, this is the solarium, the uh, indoor space exclusively to the jewel suite. Man, let me say it right. I want to say it properly. This is the solarium? The solarium. Because I'm a rapper. I need to be able to put these words in when they fit. Perfect. In the solarium, you know what I'm saying? In celery. A lot of our guests who take the suite spend a lot of time up here. Working fireplace, wood burning fireplace, New York City on the roof of my building. All of this is a part of that suite. Where we were. It's, when hard, we were... it's hard to believe there's still more to that suite, right? I see you got Ferrari books and things like that. I wish I could tell you there's a Ferrari included, it's still just amazing. Ferrari doesn't come? Yeah. Don't let me drive a Ferrari to Harlem. The best part? Hot tub. So you can imagine how the party always ends up up here. I'm so happy to be here. And that's your neighbors in the champagne suite. Careful in case anybody's naked over there. This was something I would like to experience at least one time in my life. I got to admit that. I'm from Atlanta, Georgia, and we don't have anything like this in Atlanta. I would love to use this for the view, for a party. I think I want to do my listening party in here, man. 25000 a night, bringing some hookers. 
what's not here we can set up in here because okay, we got cool. New York City the relationships any anything's possible they, right. it's down the street we, we put it in your family now so we're gonna be able to find a time to have you check this out I like to hear stuff like that right y'all yeah, yeah, heard them we got it on camera no listen I'm, I'm, I'm committed now 25,000 250,000 a month the rings in there you can't have the shit on the wall you can't have is it fucking worth it you tell me leave a comment Subscribe to the GQ channel for more most expensive shit.